Hey, how's it going everyone? It's Terry Swales here and we have had ourselves some real nice weather around here. A beautiful weekend and Monday was nice too. Temperatures up in the upper 40s to lower 50s around my neck of the woods and really all of the upper Midwest enjoying pretty good weather. And this is a weather pattern that looks like it's going to remain intact now right on through the upcoming weekend. And if anything, temperatures this coming weekend will be even warmer. Let me show you what we got going here. I got to load up my graphic here. But first of all, tomorrow is Valentine's Day. Don't forget about your sweetie dudes, okay? Should be a lovely day, breezy and mild out there. Temperatures expected to be back in the upper 30s to mid 40s around many parts of the Midwest. And then after that, there's gonna be a little bit of a cool down, especially on uh, Wednesday, when we may hold in the upper 30s. But after that, we start our next warming trend. And so the end of the week here looks mild and dry. And then we go into the weekend, and that's when things really get festive around here as far as spring is concerned. These are the temperatures that we're expecting over the next seven days right here, at least in Cedar Rapids and these are the temperature departures. So after our 38, look what happens here. We go into the weekend with temperatures 60 on Friday, 62 Saturday, 64 Sunday, and 63 on Monday. Those readings are about 24 to 29 degrees above what you typically expect and readings that would be more typical of late April. And we went back and looked into the books here just to give you an idea of how unusual this is. The last time we had four consecutive days in February in the 60s was back in 1931. So it's been about 86 years since we've had a stretch of weather like this during the month of February. So hopefully you'll be able to get out and enjoy it this weekend when we head for highs up in the 60s. And one other nice thing about this weather pattern is that the westerly flow that's producing the warmth also does not have any moisture, so not too much in the way of clouds, and it don't have any rain or snow in the forecast for the next seven days across the central Midwest. Things do get a little more active as we get into next week, and that'll also cool down the temperatures, but not before probably readings get back in the 60s by Monday, and then towards the middle of next week, we'll start dropping the temperatures. So um, if you like it warm and spring-like, this is definitely the forecast for you. Enjoy, my friends.